Yu-Gi-Oh! Duel Links was released in Japan on November 17, 2016 and globally on January 11, 2017. With nostalgia and the allure of fast, simple duels, it quickly gained the attention of fans both old and new. Only a few boxes were in the game at the time of release. Ultimate Rising, Age of Discovery, and Neo Impact were the only selections to choose from, but with powerful cards like Sphere Karibo, Mirror Wall, and Michizur, they were all crucial to build a competent deck for the ranked ladder. In this series, both PDS and I will be taking you on a journey through the ages of Duel Links. Each episode will be showcasing some meta decks that were available in that time period, and spinning a wheel to determine which deck we will be using to duel each other. This is the history of Yu-Gi-Oh! Duel Links. Hello everyone, welcome to the history of Yu-Gi-Oh! Duel Links. I'm PDS. So this is going to be the deck overview. We're just going to be going over the decks for you guys. We're not necessarily going to play every deck in each episode, but I just wanted to briefly go over what each of the deck on the wheels is and what they do. So the first deck is the Dinosaur Beatdown deck. The deck's main objective is to get your opponent's life points to zero with your dinosaur monsters. This deck was extremely popular because all of the monsters are really easy to get. They're only rares. Except for Sphere Karibo, because obviously it's a UR. So these decks are extremely optimized. You know, they have three Order Charge, three Mirror Wall, three Sphere Karibo. Not everybody back in the day had that. They just were playing with whatever they had with. But we wanted to show you guys the decks at their full power. So the next deck on the list is going to be the Fusion Dinosaur deck. It's very similar to the last list. Except this list, it allows you to play Thinner Dragon and Polymerization for the Brachio, Brachio Radius. And the one-headed thunder dragon so this deck list was more popular amongst the free-to-play players because you didn't necessarily need the sphere creepos you just put in uh the thunder dragons and then that filled up your deck so you didn't need as many uh you know uh of the expensive cards both of these decks took advantage of the dinosaur kingdom field spell which boosted your dinosaur monsters to make them even bigger beaters so then the next deck on the list is going to be the umu beatdown deck this deck took advantage of Kaiser Seahorse. It allows you to tribute summon for a light monster and it counts as two tributes. So that gets you the Sangha of Thunder. Everything gets the field spell boost from Mystic Depths. And you play the High Tide as a beater. Grey Lambs allows you to tribute set the Sangha of Thunder. It still plays the Mirror Wall and Michizuri. This deck was extremely expensive as well. One of the most expensive decks back in the day because you needed multiple URs from multiple boxes. So the final deck we have is Daedalus OTK. This deck list was uh, kind of expensive, but not as expensive as the last one. This one you only had to, uh, you know, you had to go into one mini box three times. So Daedalus is the boss monster. It lets you send one face up Umin you control thanks to the skill. And then you destroy all other cards on the field. So extremely powerful effect. It plays Suijin instead of Sangha because you play the Unshaven Angler, which allows, it's the same as Kaiser Seahorse, but for water monsters. And then of course you have the high tide as a beater and then you have stray lamb same purpose as the other deck this deck plays big wave small wave which allows you to destroy as many face up water monsters as you control and then special summon that many from your hand so that is how you set up the otk you can also summon daedalus from your hand that way so it is extremely powerful deck of course you can break so that is the one thing that held the deck back but yeah one final note guys a lot of you might be asking yourself, why didn't players save gems? You know, what if they wanted to see what was coming up next? At this time, actually, Duel Links was removing boxes as they went along. So these boxes were going to be gone, you know, as far as we knew for good after a certain amount of time. So people were trying to get these cards very quickly, especially Sphere Cravo Mirror Wall. Extremely powerful cards and they wanted to get their hands on them. And now, without further ado, let's see what decks me and Kazars are going to be playing this week. What's up guys, I'm Kazaris. I'm an avid Duel Links player and YouTuber. I've been playing the game since the beginning, uh, competitively as well. A little casually at the, at the beginning, but as, as I got, as the months went on, I got more and more competitive, as as I usually do with games. Uh, I, I grew to like it a lot, especially like the early beatdown formats, so I'm excited to do this first episode. And you can find me over at my YouTube channel if you do enjoy this content. I have a lot of uh, chiller videos over there, just a lot of, I drink some coffee, I play some jazz in the background. And I play some really cool spicy decks or just some competitive decks, kind of my mood changes with the wind. So check me out if you enjoy it and let's just get right into our spin. Ideally, I'd get one of the combo, de oh, combo decks, one of the quote unquote combo decks, Fusion Dino or Daedalus. There weren't, wasn't much of a combo back in the day. Let's spin the wheel and see what we get. All right. So give me something here. Give me one of those two quote unquote 
combo decks. Uh, Fusion Dino. Wow. Barely getting it. All right. All right. So that's good. Um, one of the decks I wanted to play. So awesome. Let's just get into the deck list. All right. We are back in the game client now. And this is the list we're going to be rocking for the very first episode of History of Duel Links 3. Thunder Dragon, three Crawling Dragon number two, with three Two-Headed King Rex, three Enemy Controller, three Order to Charge, two Polymerization, and three Mirror Wall. The fusion targets are, of course, Twin-Headed Thunder Dragon, just two Thunder Dragons, very easy to make, and three uh, Brachioradius. You don't th need three. We only have two Polys, so we can only ever summon either two Brachioradius or one Twin-Headed Thunder and one Brachioradius. Uh, this, the majority of the time we're going to be summoning twin headed thunder dragon, if anything at all, because, uh, we can just discard one thunder dragon to add two. And then there will be our two targets for poly. You could play a third poly, but it's like, it's kind of a brick. Like I don't always want to go for a fusion, uh, like thunder dragon to the very least will thin the deck, which means I can draw more of my back row and monsters and I have a higher chance of drawing polymerization. So, I mean, most of the time we're going to be relying on like beat down with econ and order to charge and mirror wall but the fusion is just there as an option so this is the list let's try and get the very first win of the series get a nice little streak going to start that would be very awesome let's see what pds has all right boys let's see what the wheel gives me let's go dinos please dinos dinos let's go oh i'm cooming thank you all right I got fusion dinos. I actually know quite a bit about this deck. It's actually it's one of the first decks I played to get KOG, so I'm pretty happy I got that. Alright boys, so I rolled fusion dinos, so this is going to be my deck list. Typically they played three thunder dragon, three crawling dragon number two, three two headed king rex. So this monster lineup is pretty self explanatory. Basically the whole goal of the deck is just summon out the biggest dinosaur possible and you know, just go monkey, ooh, ah, swing, get him down to zero life points. So this deck was played alongside with the other Dino deck, which is just like a control-based version. But they didn't play the Polymerization, three Econs, and then three Order to Charge, very uh, powerful with your normal monsters, normal dinosaurs. So basically what it does is you select one face-up normal monster on your side of the field, and you tribute it. And then you can destroy a monster on your opponent's side of the field. So it's really good interruption. Obviously, it's not as good as something like Treacherous. But back in the day, this was an insanely powerful card. The one polymerization, typically, you would run one to two. I opted to play a Twister because Mirror Wall, which is the, not the final card. So Mirror Wall is an insanely powerful card back in the day. It's not easy to get rid of. Twister was like one of the only ways to get rid of it. It's worth noting here that Twister cannot be activated during the damage step. I'm just using it to get rid of Mirror Wall so I can make a push. Even though I lose a card and I lose my Twister, I still like it because I can make a push over the Mirror Wall. Otherwise, it would be stuck on the board for at least two turns. But yeah, guys, that's my deck. Now let's see what Kazaris got and see if we can crush him. <laughs> Alright boys, so we are now at the moment of truth. I am now going to be going 1v1 versus Kazaris. What's uh, up? About to join this table. Oh yeah, bring it on. Duel Links History. The Duel Room, Duel Links History 1. I am excited. First of many. Um, best of five as well, just because it's Duel Links format. So the games will be a little bit slower um, than actual TCG games. So just extend it a little bit. Get some more games in. Make it a little bit more fair. Alright. All right, here we go. Let's go. Ready, ready when you are. All right, that's. Oh no! Did it already? Did... Yeah. All right, all right we're good. We're good. Okay. Let's go. All right, here we go. Classic dual room errors. Yes. It's I mean, it's funny because even since the game came out, uh, they've been bugged, so nothing's changed. God, dual room. Oh no! Remember the shadow game? Oh oh. Yes. Oh, here we go. Yeah, Did we shadow get the games. Did we get the mirror? Still a 50% 50 chance that we didn't. I'm going first. All right. Ooh -hoo. <laughs> no side decks either because side decks we can maybe like do side deck wow this hand is doo-doo um we could maybe do side decks later like when side decks were actually starting to become a thing with the links meta, meta and whatnot but like early the links was all louder oh no 
It is the mirror. It's the mirror. Damn, oh, no. that's crazy. All right. Fusion Dino boys. Oh man, did you? Okay, so you're just summoning. Oh wow, these boys are big too. Yeah, because they get the double oh, field spell. No. Oh no. All right, let's go. No, go I can't. I can't take that. I right. cannot take that, sir. I cannot start taking that. All right. Argument. Oh, come on, man. Ooh. All right. Crawling oh, dragon. Else? There's there's always gonna be a delay on summon, right? Yeah, there has to yeah. be. Yeah. Right, Blardle phase. As YouTube Dan would say. Mm. Blardle. Ooh. The back row is like on. so much more important now. I know, I just the, mm. Oh no. No, I'm gonna hold it. That's fine. That's fine, that's fine. Okay. Pay that that's like the difference in this game too, like we can try and read delays. So and there's a big difference yeah. going on. Another Back in the day, I don't think anybody was reading delays. Yeah, true. Nobody, it, people felt the delays, but they didn't really understand what they meant. Yeah. Oh, no. Let's oh, see. no. <laughs> so scared. Oh, God. All right, well, I have to do this. I have to clear one of them. No. Oh. Auto to charge. This card doesn't target either. Like, yeah, it's pretty the powerful. earliest cards. It doesn't target. Oh, I mean, it is a, a minus one, but... It is like one of it was like the earliest removal we had. Yeah, exactly. I mean, like, my like cards that don't target, even if they are a minus one, are just like especially good. Like early Duel Links was all minus ones. Early yeah. Yu-Gi-Oh was all minus one, really. Um, and two, even current Duel Links attack. is all minus ones, honestly. Like Karma Cut or Gaki Break. Yeah. It's just all minus one. But they're really oh, good. No, I, minus I just one. lose. <laughs> I just lose. Let's go. No mirror wall, please. No. Uh, all right, my only, my only chance is for you to hit no on the replay battle. <laughs> <laughs> all right, Dang. so we, let's go. No, neither one of us actually fused. You just had yeah. more monsters than I did. That's all yeah, I that's how it usually goes. Maybe if I had to save that econ from the beginning. All right, all right, try it again. That's Game really two. like that's the difference, like the make or break for early Yu-Gi-Oh. Like if you saved one extra card than your opponent, that could make or break the game. All right. Yeah, like those early econ. Econ's really really powerful. It's like yeah, this obviously right. And then right. We have it at three too. So. Yeah. Oh my god, I can't. Until like 2018, Sylvan format, I believe. Yeah, and three TTH right as well. Oh my god, that's nice. All right, all right. Now you're going first. I opened the nuts. Wow, a power, powerful starting starting hand. This is like Madrat and an equip back in the day. <laughs> this is like... 80% yeah. uh, chance to open a normal dino. Hmm. Um, no, what do I want to do? Uh, so many decisions. Hmm. Uh, couldn't have the mirror wall. All right, I think I will see your normal summon set to pass and call your normal summon Ooh. set to pass. Right. Strong moves from both sides. Hey, let's see. Double Jurassic World. Big, beefy Dino Boys. 2200 is massive. Oh, no, another back row. Oh, <laughs> another. I'd be drawing monsters oh, like it's my man. job. Yeah. The, what do I want to do this... here? Hmm. Decisions. This is like like a chicken game right now. Oh, more of a Christian. Yeah, it is. <laughs> it's like uh, Cold War. So you can build up more weapons first. Mm. <laughs> Literally, it's just like whoever starts swinging first. This uh, is so unfortunate. I know. It's just like there's like one I of three back row that it could be. Oh, you aren't going to do it. Damn it. He didn't fear the mirror wall. Um. Okay. All right. Um, okay. That's good. Wait. Hmm? Oh, okay, I see. That's... Do you see? Let's see. Hmm. He gets to choose his own hmm. decisions, decisions. Yeah, this is fine. Battle step. Crash is fine. All right. Maybe we're in there. Thunder Dragon off the top. Damn it. Okay. Um. Crawling dragon. Crawling. My crawling dragon will destroy your crawling dragon. Are you sure about that? Is it going? Is it going through? Oh, there is a mirror wall off the top. Okay. 
That's fine. I'll take some. I'll take 700. That's, that's nothing. That's nothing. I can still take. Still takes two attacks to kill. Uh, we are. We are chilling. Not in any any bad position. Oh, he's going to pay for the wall. Build that wall. I'm just kidding. Let's go. All right. Hmm. Okay. Already. Already. Order now the charge. order charge has to come down. That's a good card. Get it out of. Get it out of here. Get it off the field. All right. Hopefully, uh, I mean, he has to ask monsters, or he hasn't said anything. Huh? There's another one. Smacking for 11. Get that damage in. That sweet, sweet damage. Ooh, 11. Yeah, it's gonna take it. All right. So I feel, I feel like you have your own econ order to charge face down. Unfortunately, that's how it's gonna have to be. So two. Oh, top deck's a monster. That's mm. cool. I needed that. I mm. desperately needed that. All right. Uh, All right. That, yeah, this, this is a this is a pat. Yeah, this is a pass position <laughs> for sure. Already, already, already. Oh. Hmm. Is this my? Yeah, this is my third. My third Rex. Oof. Rex. I got two two headed. Two two headed. Coming down. Does it go through? Does he have the second mirror wall? Ooh, entered damage step. Oh, he does have. The <laughs> okay. All right, that's fine. Oh no. I know. I I know. I, I have see, my. I see now. Maybe I should I should turn my toggle off. Unfortunately. Dang it. That was a misplay. Now you know I have the mirror wall because there's literally no other damage step thing except yeah. like what re reinforcements. But <laughs> we're not playing reinforcements. Hmm. I have yeah, to mirror play wall's dead. Mm-hmm. End phase. Coming down. Draw for turn. Oh my god, dude. Early duel links. <laughs> Where are my Thunder Dragons at, dog? Oh, it's god. funny because we're both playing Fusion Dinos, right? I know. We yeah, haven't fused this. Uh, you, you either have a, you ha you have a poly as well. Yeah. You, I know you have yeah. a poly. Let's see. One card in hand. Yeah. Where are my monsters? I don't know. <laughs> oh, wow. I set a 600 timer that way we don't actually lose the time. Oh, nice. We shouldn't need it, but yeah. Just so that we're actually playing the game. We might lose the turns though. No. I'm just yeah. Kidding. Oh wait, no turn. Wait. Do, wait, does it end after turns? No, nah, it ends after going... uh, turn 50. Yeah. Oh, it the does. Those stall mirrors back in the day. Oh right. Oh, yeah. I remember that. That was yes. chaos, dude. They would like loop the gladiator beast over and over again. Mm -hmm. All right, so that's. Two mirror walls in the grave. What are the odds of the third? I don't. I forget about the delay already. I don't know if I, there was another one. Um. And now I just gotta summon. Okay. Attempt to swing. Third mirror wall or bust. Or just double econ. I guess works too. There's one econ. You got a tribute take. All right, that's fine. Yeah, that's fine. No. Always take the non-attacking. Oh, ho, ho. that's good. Cool. That was a three for two, still though. Yeah, I needed to do it though. Yeah, you had to. Yeah. Oh, yeah, that's a good card. Good. No. No. Okay. All right. All right. We're fine. All right, we're fine. Setting two. They're both poly. Oh my god. All right, <laughs> both poly. Uh, two of them are two of them are bluff poly and right now. One one is one's an econ, two are bluff polys. Here we All go. Right. Oh my god. Your wall's are gone. Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? Oh my god. Nine eight cards in deck. Where are my thunder dragons, dude? You better not draw it first. Don't do it. Oh you little booger. <laughs> god dang it. Oh I lose. Show me the show me the poly. Show you the poly. I wish I had it. I legit don't have it. Let's see. What? Wow, mm. I got it in scoop. Jesus Christ. Scoop. Oh man. What do I do here? It's passed. Yeah, because you can't know if it's order to charge or econ. I can't even commit that much. Bruh. 
Come on, dude. I'm out of normal. Literally, Thunder Dragon Fusion is my only play. Are you really out of normal summons? Wow. Yeah. That's I crazy. Only, I mean, only six dinos. Like, you could argue for, like, the Element Source, I guess. Like, nah. He can't. Wow, he's going for it. You didn't go for it last turn, and now that the odds are even higher, you're going for it. I gotta go for it. God damn it. Okay, alright. Alright, oh. right, that, that makes more sense, okay. Right, so third mirror wall will help me live here. If you just attack with my monster, I was dead. Oh, <laughs> uh, yes. I was afraid oh you god, had an enemy dude. controller. Oh my god. Are you trip double poly mirror wall. Rip. Oh, Let's rip. Go. No, it's 2 0. Alright, back three. Back three. Here we go. Yeah, we were talking a little bit uh, before. This is actually my first KOG deck. One of my first really? ones. Oh. Yeah. What was mine? I feel like it was this. I can't even remember because I, I remember I was playing both back, both decks back in the day. But I can't remember what it was. Yeah, I had a really bad build though. I had like Michizure and I had like Wonder Balloons. I, yeah, I, didn't I, have, I, yeah. I only had one mirror wall. So. I wasn't dropping the big bucks yet. I yeah. Really had a, yeah, I think it, I think I had Sphere Kribas in there or something. Really? Oh my god, dude. Have I gone first every duel? No, no, I went first game one. Like, what, is, what kind of nonsense? I don't see Thunder Dragon two games in a row, and now I see two of them. Mm. Like, <laughs> that's Thunder Dragon for you, I guess. The go card. Mm -hmm. Actually, go as well. Go control. <sighs> do I just do it as well? Yeah, I, I like it in Goat. Some people don't play it, but I like it in Goat. Yeah, me too. Alright, mm. let's... Decisions. To do it or not to do it. So only adding one Thunder Dragon. Okay. Yeah. Well, at least... At least we're finally getting off a fusion in our fusion dino deck. Oh, and you have the poly from the structure deck. Yeah, I know. Technically, technically illegal. Technically was not out, but... I'm jelly. Functionally, it's the same. One Headed is actually one of my favorite fusions. Yeah, from, it's so, uh, so cool looking. Forbidden Memories. Oh, really? Oh, wow, that game. Wait, mm -hmm. was Forbidden Memories the one with... No, D no, Dark Dole Stories, DDS. Was Those it the one cards. with the what? Dark Dole, Dark Dole Stories, DDS, Blue Eyes, and Dark Oh, yes, 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 with the really yeah, expensive yeah. cards, yeah. yeah. So nuts. They're like thousands of dollars. Yeah, it's know. insanity. Like a few years ago, they were like... You can maybe get one for like five, six hundred. But like the blue eyes is the most expensive one, obviously, because it's the most playable. Yeah, it's crazy, um, actually. Yeah, but but now they're both like over a thousand for sure. Yeah. And they're what I would give to own them, dude. Mm. I would sell my kidney <laughs> to buy every expensive Yu-Gi-Oh card. Let's see. No lie. I can live with one kidney. My friend actually owns three of them. It's crazy. They the value yeah, on them sense. is. They valued so much. Wait, three blue eyes or three? Yeah, dominoes? three of the blue eyes. Yeah. That's crazy. Yeah, yeah, that's fine. Take it. Right. Hit me. Hit this me is down. what Yu-Gi-Oh is all about. Yeah. Swinging in with your big, big dinos. Big bungus is beaten down. Big bungus beat down. Uh. Okay. That's fine, I guess. Yeah, but you guys gotta realize that back in the day. Nobody had like three mirror walls or anything. Yeah, it, we were like, just we're playing optimally just because we can now. Yeah. So, like, Back then, we didn't even have econ. I didn't have a single econ. I never I remember think that. I, had, I think I had one. I think I was fortunate enough to get one. I didn't realize how like lucky I was. Oh shit! I had my toggle off. Oh no! Let's go. Wait. Well, I mean, well, I don't think it mattered because I had econ to change one to defense and then mirror wall to live. But then I lose two cards. You keep your. Then it's then it's five to three. Yeah. If I top deck a monster, what was what was your back row? I had to double mirror wall or to charge. Yeah, yeah, they're like they're I was so far behind already. I had to, yeah. I had to commit I didn't even go plus one off the Thunder Dragon, so I went minus two to summon the twin headed and then you just ordered to charge me. So Yeah. Unfortunate. Unfortunate. But wow. Three oh. I mean this first. isn't like skilled Yu Gi Oh, you know, this is just play your hand basically. It's something, exactly. yeah. So it really it just comes down to who draws better like, exactly. throughout the course of the duel yeah. because like if I draw a ton of back row in a row and he draws a ton of monsters, I'm gonna have to lose all my back row just to stop the attacks. And yeah. you don't lose actual any actual card advantage. So it's a, it's a little yeah. tough. 
Very unfortunate. Um, but at least we got a fusion in that last duel. Yes, finally. Um, How many um, polys were you playing, actually? I was playing two. So, I, two. so my, my list was three Thunder Dragon, three Twin Headed, three Rex, three Econ, three Order, two Poly, three Mirror Wall. I had the yeah. same thing, except I put in one poly and one twister. Okay, so you did have the twister. Yeah. So I was debating a sphere Kribo as well, but like. Oh yes. I, w I wanted to see the poly because twin headed is nice, but I, I just for any other matchup besides Dino, like without order to charge, it was like really hard to out the, the twin headed besides like battle traps. Right. So like there was no way like if I was playing defensively, there was no way for you to offensively out it. Like you could econ take with it. If I had an econ, I could protect it. So I was like, yeah. I don't know. I just wanted to see it. I just wanted to summon it as well because. I've had this prismatic one for a while, but I just never summoned <laughs> it because you don't actually play it. Yeah, exactly. So, Not anymore. Yeah. So glad I got to summon it at least. Oh well, three zero in the first episode. Um, what can we look forward to next? So next is what Flames of the Tyrant. Yeah. So we got uh, some mill strategies. Oh uh, god. I do remember people were playing that Tyrant Dragon like way back when, like you know they uh, were. It was Kid Moto. I think yeah, it was uh, no, did. it was uh, Lord of D. I think Lord of D. Fluto summoning. Dragons. Oh right, yeah. right, right, right. Yeah, that was some. Okay, that was a nonsense. Yeah. You could also technically do like Totem Dragon Kid Moto. Yeah, 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 for sure. With like blue eyes and I don't know. We'll, 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 we'll craft up some lists. We'll do some research and figure it out. I also had Electro. Electro control decks for Yes, strong. Electro. Dude, literally, Electro with Mirror Wall is the FTK. Like, it, it is It is so hard to get over it. It is so... You, you can't out the... Because you have to set back row. And if you can't out the Electro on the first turn, you're getting... Your back row locked. It's yeah. just, as long as Electro remains on the field, you just lose back row. It's just absolutely nuts. And it was interesting um, also because back then you could, uh, you know, take their Electro and lock their own back row, and then as long as it's stuck in the field. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. yeah. Right. So there's a oh, whole bunch the, of cute stuff you could do. That was the cool play. You can't take. Yeah. Um, Guardian Statue. Uh, got Sphered won the first MCS with like Heavy Knight of the Flame. That's not for a long time. Oh dude. Longer. Oh, I love Heavy yeah. Knight of the Flame. He's so that, cool. Me too. That's like. We're getting into like, this is early, but Red Eye Zombie is not that far off. He's uh, getting pretty close. Um, insight is another yeah, Rez, card that Rez Meta nobody was had. I, I had zero insight. Dude, oh, yeah, insight. I remember that worlds. Everybody was fuming because they didn't have any insight. They it didn't the have any deck. spirit. Yeah, it is the best deck. One yeah, of the best. Without deck. a doubt. Well, yeah, because like ninjas had just come out too. It was Electric Overload. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And Timmy, we want Timmy and Tutpup finals. Yeah. Uh, Toon Mirror Match. T Timmy just opened... What did he open? He opened Toon Kingdom, Toon Table, Toon Rollback to grab the... Yeah, exactly, yeah. Girl. It was a complete like, sack. Just, just I think the first, stuff. like, two or three worlds were just complete sacks. Like, it's duelings, yeah. Gross. It's just gross. Anyway. But Sorry. yeah, doing Anything this... Uh, doing this, I realized I need to pick up my third Prismatic Econ. It's a, oh, yeah. Uh, so I only I, ever I, had, I had two of them. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> that pissed me off. Because I, I, I only got it when... Uh, what was that too? First, yeah. Yeah, and they would like introduce like the prismatic selection tickets around then. Too. Yeah, I got it uh, from the KC Cup back when yeah, it. Right. All right, that was fun. All right, I yes, I, had, I enjoyed myself. All right, Even guys. though I got three would in very disappointingly, I still yes. had a lot of fun just playing this format just in general. Yeah, no, it is. It is a great there. format. Yeah, it's so nostalgic. Yeah. yeah, especially if you guys played since the beginning like us, then you know you'll know. Like, oh exactly. yes, I remember those decks. They're really fun. And I started playing Chinese Duel Links, but unfortunately got locked out because oh. they they uh they were requiring you to add your Chinese ID. Which, oh no! Not being Chinese, I do not have one of those. Yeah. So I got my enjoyment of the early format in while I could, but unfortunately can't anymore. So this should uh be another outlet for that at least, another nostalgia trip. Yes, yes, yes. Fun. All right. Well, All right, guys. Good duels. Uh, well, thank you guys. Uh, I'm welcome. I'm Kazaris, DLE, uh, unofficial DLE member, I guess. Mm -hmm. um, uh, check me out at my YouTube channel. Uh, same name, Kazars. Um, I guess you'll put it in the description below. Yes, it will be in the um, description, uh, guys. You want to check him out? He does a lot of cool uh, replay videos, a lot of interesting deck ideas. Yep, just a little chill channel. I drink a lot of coffee, so come drink coffee with me and chillax. Uh, but right. yeah, thanks for having me. I appreciate All right, guys. it. Guys, fun. See you. Uh, see you next week, guys. Peace.